It is more than just a documentary about a hospital, at least that's what those involved say, about a film from the Mayo Clinic about the providers' deep roots in La Crosse, roots that tie the community together with compassion and care. Called Lighting the Flame, this new film highlights the partnerships and parallels at the heart of the Mayo Clinic Health System Franciscan Healthcare. The constant through all of the years um, of the Franciscan Sisters of Perpetual Adoration and the Skimp Clinic and Mayo Clinic have been the values that they share. Director Tom Williams says he hopes audiences value both the original images and score and how his team condensed into 25 minutes, 150 years of history, telling the story of how the three organizations formed and eventually met in the place where three rivers meet. A story that continues to this day. The thing that hit me when I moved back to the area to actually practice was that, you know, there's just so many wonderful people here that I work with every day, whether it's physician colleagues, nursing staff, people that keep the hospital lights on and the floors clean, and obviously the patients. So it's it's been just a great experience. While Dr. Skemp carries on the legacy, now with 30 plus years at the facility of his forefathers, he says it's nice to see how his family's physical care tradition ties in with the community's spiritual health. We hoped we'd always balance the care of the body with the care of the soul. The film shows how a small religious group, some of whom emigrated from Bavaria, overcame personal tragedy, eventually making their way to La Crosse to establish Western Wisconsin's first hospital and the nation's first practice of perpetual adoration. There was smallpox and diphtheria and typhoid and then polio, and then HIV AIDS, and now COVID. So the preparation and the compassion uh, that comes to the care of our friends and family, very important. And it's also really a story about the history of La Crosse. This burgeoning town on the western side of Wisconsin, on the river, and it's exploding in growth. There are river boats coming in but there are no medical facilities to take care of the thousands of people who have settled here. Not only does the film explain how care evolved on the banks of a booming river town, but it also examines a history that's surprisingly similar to another renowned provider, the Mayo Clinic itself in Rochester. So we have the Franciscan sisters in both cities partnering with two physician brothers to create great healthcare organizations. So as I finished watching the film, I said to myself, you know, it's all predicated on values. As featured in what's now a valued part of the Mayo Heritage Films Library. Of Lighting the Flame is now available to stream on the Heritage Films page of the Mayo Clinic's website, which includes a variety of stories related to the provider, including one fans of another film, Field of Dreams, might enjoy. Dr. Mueller says he was also involved in the piece called the real Moonlight Graham, a life well lived. It turns out he was an e even bigger human being than what's portrayed in the f in Field of Dreams. And we told that story. And if you watch it, Vin Scully, the voice of baseball, is the moderator throughout. And you can find links to both of those films over at our website, wxw.com.